What's up, you guys? Well, I'm not really putting it on the stand, the camera today. Just gonna try to wing a one-shot video. Um, no editing. Um, you know, Sabres lost to Colorado, but then he had a couple of days off, back in the black and red, and we beat the San Jose Sharks. Thank God we beat Arendelle. I would have been severely embarrassed if we lost to Arendelle. Um, you know, but the positives to take away from these games, yes, Buffalo, we're scoring goals. We're one of the top teams in goal scoring. But a downside is, and I'm pretty sure all of you Sayer fans know, we are probably, if not the highest goals allowed in the National Hockey League. Penalty kill has been suffering here and there. Power play... It has its moments. It has its good moments. Um, but just the consistency in defense, lackluster goaltending. Um, you know, it's just been lacking there in goaltending and defense. It's 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 tough to watch, you guys. Um, to just to see that it's some good efforts that we've had in games like against Tampa. In Colorado, like, scoring four to five goals a game, we should be winning games, but we're losing because we have just not physical enough in our own zone. Some soft goals by goaltending, you know. There's just still some components that this team is missing from it possibly being a playoff contender. But, um, you know, but as I mentioned in a post that, you know, haven't been feeling well. You know, I was just trying to enjoy the games, try to get through the weekend. And, you know, God bless my fiance for sticking by my side, looking out for me. You know, I try my best to look out for her. You know, I'm grateful for everything that has happened so far. Um, rough day at work today, but uh, also been doing some work in our own home especially right here in this room. Um, it's been kind of, it was kind of a tight fit, you know, with how I was doing the videos and everything. Um, but I could say now that the room is coming along, you know, this is a spot now where a bed used to be, but now it's a futon. Um, you know, I'm starting to get a little bit more up on the walls um, definitely, uh, definitely, guys, if you sit in this room, you you definitely feel the passion and the dedication of being a Buffalo Sabres fan. Um, I'll give you a little tour here. It's still under some progress, but it's come a long ways since when I st with what I started. As you can see, some logos up there. Um, figured I'd keep those together. On the wall. Might be a little bit more added to this wall. Um, got these nice three uh, <laughs> posters right up here. Going up in a nice formation. I feel like that's a nice display right there. On the door, got some Sabres jackets right there. I just put them up there. Um, the ones covering the one that I feel like is a good display. Um, of course, got the nice... Buffalo City flag with the Sabres logo, which got from the home opener. I love this flag. Keeping this, try to keep this thing in good shape as, for as long as I can. And, of course, the Sabres jersey collection here. Including with the, uh, well, you can't see it because it's blocked off from the closet. But uh, the new reverse retro and... New red and black third jersey in the back there. As a matter of fact, let me see if I can turn on light here. As you see from inside the closet, guys. Probably displaying stuff up in this closet.
I love this photo of Kevin uh, with Kevin Adams, uh, Kim Pagula. Hope you're doing well. And wondering what I can put in this blank spot right here. I'm still trying to f figure it out, guys. But um, some takeaways from <laughs> just set of my hockey gloves. Um, some takeaways from those two games. Like I said. Plenty of goal scoring. Uh, Darlene. <laughs> hit, big hit. 90 said, I will say. On, on Nieto, if I pronounce his name right, Nieto. Hit him so hard that they broke the ice, from what some people have said. Um, but this team is fun to watch. I will say, I will take, this is a takeaway, this team is fun to watch, but just got to get that goaltending, got to get that defense, um, power, you know, you know, still learning, he's still young, yes, you know, and Darlene, elite, reaching that elite status, up there with Eric Carlson and a couple of other guys, but... Matias Samuelson, very tough guy, you know, gritty guy. Never expected him to be like a point maker, two-way defenseman, but probably one of our better defensemen in our own zone. But there's just, you know, some things with other the other defensemen on our team. It's a lot of work, guys. This is a very young team. We're the youngest team in the National Hockey League. But in conclusion of this video, guys, I got plenty more upcoming. I'm going to be helping out with the charity event that's going to be taking place at Buffalo River Works on Saturday and Sunday, um, this December 10th and the 11th. Uh, we got a 50-50 charity raffle going. I actually got a item that will be up for the raffle which is this lovely authentic buffalo savers reverse retro jersey right here and to also say guys um you know you guys stay safe out there you know stay healthy you know a lot of my friends and co-workers and other people that I have been ch chatting with, been getting sick, you know, take care of yourselves, keep your hands clean, do everything possible just to keep yourself safe, you know, well-maintained, guys. Um, ain't got a game until Columbus on Wednesday, and then we got back-to-back -back against Pittsburgh. Um, but in the meantime, hoping to... Maybe get a chapter or two from Matthew Barnaby's unfiltered book. And actually got a couple of jersey unpacking to do. And yes, I got pretty much every Sabres jersey. And I will not tell you what jerseys these are, but they are very special to me. And especially if you are a hockey fan. So if you guys want to take a guess of what they possibly could be. Um... guys um go right ahead and leave a comment in the comment box down below that is it for tonight i uh, like i said take care and be safe guys hit like if you like this video subscribe to my channel and i'm looking forward to finishing up this room and bringing more videos to you guys so and leave comments on what else you would like to hear from me. And also, I will try to, if you guys follow me on Twitter, follow me on social media, um, leave questions for me, you know, for upcoming videos. Take care, you guys. Be safe.